Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you liked my previous video. In this video, I will teach how to make a space shooter game in Scratch. So now let's get started. First, I'll be uploading a rocket. Now you can upload a backdrop of your choice. I'll be uploading the galaxy backdrop. Now upload some rocks or asteroids which can be our obstacles. Decrease the size of the rocket and the asteroid. That's okay. Now we will do the coding part. First, we want the rocket to move around the screen. So, we can take an if block, then forever, if, right arrow key pressed, and again duplicate it and write if left arrow key pressed. Now, Go to motions and take a change x block, change x by 10 and in the second one change x by minus 10. Now first we need it to go here at the beginning. So we can take a go to block and put it at the beginning and also take uh, take a show block from the looks. Now, let's do the rocks coding. First, when we will take when the flag clicked, now we will create a variable named score. And also a variable named speed. Now first take set score to 0 and go to looks and take the show block. Then go to control and take repeat and we will make it repeat twice. Then go and take a create clone of my self block and then go to looks again and take a height block now as we created create clone of myself now uh, we will take the block when i start as a clone then we go to motions and take a go to block and go to operators and take pick random 186 to minus 179 and set y by 163. Now go to variables and take the set block and set speed to pick random minus 2 to minus 5. Now take a repeat until block. Touching edge. Then change y by speed. So we will go to motions and take a change y block and from variables a speed block now we will take an if block
and put it under change y by speed. Now we will select the touching rocket ship. Touching the rocket ship, we want it to change the score by 1. Or if the asteroid is touching the rocket ship, we can make it make the game over. So you can take a broadcast message and type a new message named game over. Then take again an if block by duplicating it and put it under it. Now we can upload a sprite of a button, this blue button and then we can go to its costumes and edit a bit to make it a laser. And now we can change its direction to 180 and decrease its size to 20%. Now we will go back to the rocks coding part and select button 2. And now you can rename this button to sprite as the laser. Then let's go back again to the rock coding part. When if it's touching the laser, we want it to change score by 1. So we will go to variables and change score by 1. Then we also want it to go to its starting position. So it comes down again. So we will duplicate go to pick random one. And then we can add a sound. So go to the sound section and select a sound from the sound library. You can choose the magic spell option. It sounds like this. Now after selecting it, you can apply it in the coding part. Starts on magic spell. Then beneath it we can again add an if block. In that if block, we can select if touching edge, the edges of the stage. We want it to create clone of itself. So we will go to control and select the create clone of myself. And then we want it to delete its clone. If it's touching the edge. So now for now we can test out the code if the rock comes down. The rock will go over here and we also need to join these so the code works. Now the rocks are falling down one by one and if they touch the edge and if they touch the bullet a sound will come. So now we want to make the coding of the bullet. So the bullet fires. So go to the bullet sprite. Take a when flag click block. Go to its looks and take a hide block. Take a forever block. And put go to rocket ship. So it forever follows the rocket ship. Now we when it the we want when the space key is pressed to fire the bullet. So we will go to events and take when space key pressed. Create clone of myself. Create clone of myself, and then when it starts as a clone, so we'll take a block named when I start as a clone we will select go to option go to and then you can go to the sensing and put this in put this in the X position and instead of backdrop you can select you can select the X 
instead of stage you can select the rocket ship and instead of x position you can select y yes now go to looks and take a show block Now take a repeat until block and select touching edge. Touching edge and then change Y by 10. So go to motions and take the change Y block. And now you can add beneath everything delete this clone so it deletes itself now it's good so now for now we can test out the code and also you can go to variables and hide the speed block now let's try to play the rocket ship can move it can shoot, the score increases, and if it touches the asteroids, nothing happens. So now we will make the game over screen. So paint with red, you can write in the pixel font, game over. Make it big. And put it in the center. It's very important. Change X by 0 and Y by 0. So it goes in the center. Now we will go to the coding part. In the rocks, when we select if touching rocket ship, it broadcasts game over. So when the game gets over, first we will take a when flag click block. And take in looks hide block and also go to front then we will go to events and take when I receive game over we want it to show so we will take the show block from the look section and we can also make it play some little bit music so you can go in the sounds library and search for laws. It sounds like this. Select it and put it in the coding part from the sound section. S play sound laws until done and then the dangerous block of all the stop game block which will stop the game until the green flag is clicked now our game is over so we can test it out so the game gets over and everything is hidden and also you can add this option to the rocket ship go to controls or go to events and take when I receive game over you can make it hide so it is not on the screen so take a hide block now at first the score is 0 and when we shoot it the rocks disappear and the sound comes we can also move around but we the game over screen comes and the game gets stopped and it shows our score at the top as 5. I hope you liked this video. If you want more such videos, like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.